hey everyone welcome to another video on dbt so this is going to be a very quick uh, dbt tutorial and we in which we'll see like how dbt generates a lineage so let's get started so uh, D, for creating the dbt uh, lineage you don't have to take any other steps all you have to do is like if you remember while creating the documents what we did, did was we did like dbt docs generate okay so it does generate your particular document documentation to see this you can do like dvd doc sub okay so we have already gone through this particular documentation page but to see the lineage what you can do is on the right you will see like view lineage graph you just open this and you'll get a very beautiful graph on how your data is flowing from upstream to downstream systems right so if you see that we have some raw payments that is our raw data then on top of that we are creating different models right mart yeah you are creating an intermediate state then you are doing some testing and you are doing some test string also so these two are models and these two are tests you have to suppose you want to just see like what are the downstream I, um, pipelines that is using my raw data to do that you go to here all resources so basically you want to just select the models and you want to select the seats so you can do just do a update graph and it gives you like how the how the your data is flowing for now we don't have a very complex uh, model that is in place so you're just seeing few boxes here but just imagine that you have a lot like hundred of pipeline in your dbt right and this particular graph gives you the ability to just go through like each pipeline how my data is flowing from raw data to intermediate then to mart data so this this lineage helps you to identify those things and it helps you to give you a overall picture of your data model this is all i wanted to share in this video and in the next video we'll see like how to create a cd type 2 operation in dbt then we'll see like how to deploy your dbt project in production so stay tuned